Hey guys, Mystic here, and today we're going to be playing some more Slay the Princess. Last time we attempted to leave the cabin, avoid it altogether, it did not work. But we did get to see some more voice of the contrarian, and we got to see a multitude of princesses. Alright, this time I think we're going to go ahead and try to see what endings we could have gotten uh, from the previous episode. You're here to slay her. If you don't, it will be the end of the world. Ooh, I can stay in the woods forever. Okay. If I can't run away from the cabin, then I'm just staying here in the woods forever. Oh, that's clever. A little boring, though. That's all right. I'm okay with boring sometimes. It's extremely boring. Hey, we'll stay here. They can't force me. They make me so that I can't run away, so we're just going to stay here. Can we really do that? Can we really just do nothing? Of course, of course we can. No, you can't just do nothing. You have to do something. Narrator, are you going to force me? Alright, so it's decided. Even if it's boring, we're going to do nothing. Forever. Forever. Congratulations. You continue to waste everyone's time and do nothing. Wait, can you still hear me? Who's getting... Oh, 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 he's leaving. He's gone. Is that the end? What is that weird feeling? It's like I'm barely even here anymore. Oh, I guess that's the end of it. We well, didn't even get to meet the nothing, princess. That's for sure. Does that mean we messed up? Yeah, I, th I think that means we messed up, unfortunately. Yeah, we didn't even get to meet the princess. That's, uh, unfortunate. The world around you is unwound, its physical matter replaced by a textured nothing. You find yourself in the long quiet once again. Wow. Oh, okay. I don't appreciate- I don't think I like this, actually. There's a distant rumbling, a sound of many sounds. Undulations pulse louder as something other comes close. You already know it dwells in the empty spaces. Oh! Hi. Feelers probe across the fabric of reality. Extremities find your consciousness, wrap themselves around it. You're no longer alone. Confusion. Why are you here? I'm unfinished. I'm also con did I accidentally get all the people already? I I thought I used a new save. I might have just not done that. This is uh, not good. Resistance. Fingers draw clays across the glass surface of your soul. Guys, why are you here? Frustration. This vessel is full of you. It's useless to us if it doesn't bring us more gifts. Oh, we didn't kill the princess. We didn't meet her. So I guess, uh, I guess it's like, hey guys, what, what's the point? You didn't bring me anything. I'm sorry. I, uh, I'll bring you something next time. Force pushes against your will. No. You cannot go back, not there. Regret. This world is broken beyond repair. We must weave something new. A wagging finger. There are only so much thread in this place. Do not waste it. I am our only salvation. I am so confused. Did I accidentally reach the end? I don't think I did. I think this is part of this is part of not meeting the princess. Uh, the hero and the princess. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Okay, did... Is this, is this a, a legitimate restart, or are we still playing the same game where I, where I left the cabin? I don't know. Can I leave? Oh, I can't even leave. Hmm. Okay, yeah, it definitely, it seems like it started over and also I don't have the option to leave. So I'm gonna go ahead and try a different option. All right, I am back where we had all those funky little stairs. Uh, I didn't take the blade yet, but I think instead of taking the harsh stairs to the left, 
we're gonna go ahead and take these center stairs and see if that makes a difference. You step onto the center staircase. Paths wind out around you in all directions, each step branching into its own staircases, which branch into their own staircases, and so on. You aren't quite sure if yours is taking you up or down, but at the very least, it's taking you somewhere. Okay. You concentrate on where you are, careful not to stray onto any of the many splitting branches that tempt you on all sides. You wouldn't want to have to backtrack to yours once you'd made a decision that took you someplace else. Okay, we're trying to be decisive now, staying in the middle. Hopefully it stays that way. And so oh. you take one okay. careful, focused step after another. One foot down, another foot down, another after that. You lose yourself in following the correct pattern, in following what looks to be the true path, the one that cuts straight down, or up, or maybe sideways. It's not helpful, narrator. I, I need to know what goes to the princess. Presumably all of them, right? But no matter the direction it goes, it certainly is the most true path. You know that much. All right, sure. All right, so it looked like that one took us the same area. So maybe there's not any difference. Well, you're apparently a threat to the world. I was sent here to slay you. I don't have any weapons and I'm chained to a wall. Do I look like someone that could end the world? Do I look like a monster? Yes, you do. Everything you've heard about me is true and I'm going to lay waste to everything. That should not have scared me. That really shouldn't have scared me, oh my goodness. All right, let's see what happens when, there's only two of them right now. Not, not all of them everywhere at once. Let's try to do everything simultaneously. Wait, that's not right. Not right, but it happens. Go on. You take a step forward. Oh, they Your all come lands, at once. But it lands different. You experience a firm footfall, a gentle tread, a confident stride. All right, so this is probably going to do the same thing, but let's go ahead and try to take the soft stairs. You step to the right. The path feels soft and reassuring against your feet. The stairs almost seem to cradle you as you make your way down, like they're guiding your heels from one step directly to the next. You barely have to extend any effort to descend, the stairway doing most of the work for you. You don't feel like there's any concern that you might slip or tumble or lose your way. Oh, this is fantastic. This is so much better than the other stairs. But the further you go, the deeper you sink in. First, it's like a lovely plush carpet, oh, no. your toes digging down and barely hitting any resistance at all. But soon enough, you're fighting just to keep your knees from sinking out of sight. This is, a uh, less good, I think. The softness threatens to swallow you whole, to wrest control of your body and surround you in a false ethereal bliss pretending to save you from the cruelties of choice and consequence. That's awfully nice of them to do so, but I'm a little bit worried. It's slow going, but you manage to fight against the overwhelming urge to fall back into comfort and nothingness, the very struggle to continue forward consuming your every thought. Okay, so it did take us the same area, but now she's saying, are you okay, which is strange. What? What the hell was that? What I guess this middle one is now the one that cares for us. I feel so strange. Like I'm fundamentally different, but also still the same person I was at the top of the stairs. All right, so that did do the same thing, led us to the same path. We're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna ask, those walls weren't here last time. You can't just force me to go to the cabin. What are you talking about? I'm sure those walls have always been there. It makes sense if you think about it. If there weren't any walls in the woods, someone might have gotten lost. Or, heaven forbid, someone other than you might have stumbled onto the princess. Yeah, no, you put these walls there, probably. If he doesn't remember what happened, then maybe it's best to keep it that way. I don't know. I think it's more fun if he knows what we're thinking. He's like a captive audience. A captive audience, huh? He might have walled off everything but the path to the cabin, but I'm sure there's plenty of other ways we can ruin his day. Maybe. If by ruining my day, you mean ruining everyone's day forever, then yes, I suppose there are plenty of ways you could pull that off. The world really did end last time, didn't it? We should be careful. 
for all we know, we just got lucky. Maybe. The world hasn't ended yet, and you are never going to slay her with that attitude. Stuff those pathetic little voices to the back of your mind and stay focused on the task ahead. I mean, but sure. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I'm going to the cabin. All right, this time we're going to go ahead and take the blade. You take the blade from the table. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. Be honest with you guys, I don't think it's going to change anything. She's still going to... We're still going to have to do everything simultaneously at once. Okay, fine, you took the knife. But you really shouldn't hold it like that. Like what? How am I holding the knife? I'm holding it normally, I think. This is a normal way to hold the knife, okay? Stop being such a jerk. Then how are we supposed to hold it? The other way, thumb at the bottom. It'll look much cooler and more serious if we hold it with our thumb at the bottom. What? You want me to hold it upside down? You want me to turn my entire arm? It really doesn't matter how you hold the blade, as long as you have it. Just make a choice. I mean, if you give me the choice, maybe I'll, I'll choose it. Let's go ahead and hold the blade the other way, I guess? You switch your grip on the blade. Right. Congratulations. Oh, look at us. We switched it. Our thumb's at the bottom. Yes! Isn't this so much better? Sure, this is nice. <sighs> okay, fine. You're right. This does look a lot better. Okay, sure. We're all in agreement. This looks great. It really doesn't matter. Just get on with it and deal with the princess already. Ooh, we could throw the blade out the window. That's a good idea. <laughs> yes! Do it! Do it! Throw it out the window. Seriously. There it is. Ugh, out the window. Throw the blade at the window, glass showering the cabin as your weapon flies out into the night. I suppose you'll just have to deal with the princess without it. I feel as though that was not a good choice, but uh, it was fun. It was fun to do. We'll be fine. Don't worry about it. What's the worst that could happen? The world ends. Been, Been there, there. Done, done that. that. I'm not so sure. This place is already messing with my head. It would be much better if we had a weapon. What's done is done. Good luck, hero. Thank you. Alright, so we are going to take the blade this time, and you take the blade we're not going to throw table. it out the window. It would be difficult to slay the princess and save the world without a weapon. I have a sneaking suspicion that it is going to lead to the same thing, but... I'm not going to leave any stone unturned, especially since last time I didn't realize I missed a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, fine, you took the knife, but you really shouldn't hold it like that. Alright, so I did do one more thing that I want to try before I end this video, and that is to have uh, one halfway through, so right now I have already murdered the damsel. Smitten is not very happy, and instead I'm just going to leave. You can't run from your consequences forever. One way or another, you'll have to face what you've done. Nope, I uh, won't, actually. Let's see what we can find. It's bound to be more interesting than doing the same thing over again. Oh, is it just the end again? Wait, something isn't right. C can you still hear me? You're supposed to wind up at the cabin, but everything is getting... Oh, okay, so he's gone. Yep, that's the end. Oh, no. All right, so we did end up here again, where they're like, hey, what are you doing? You're not supposed to be here yet. I'm sorry, I uh, I thought something else would happen, guys. Okay, well now it gives me the option, that's strange. So it says, frustration, this vessel is full of you. I need something empty I can crawl inside of. I need something like me. Uh, well, let's go ahead and wake up, this is a nightmare. It's not, oh. Alright, and it starts over. Alright, we're back. So, that last uh, attempt just made me go back to the same path, went in, and then it just took me to the normal princess. So, we're gonna try to embrace the thoughts constricting me. Urgency. You have a story you need to finish. It's the only way for us to escape this place. Force pushing against your will. No, you cannot go back. Not there. Regret. This world is broken beyond repair. We must leave something new. 
a wagging finger. There is only so much thread in this place. Do not waste it on your only salvation. All right, so that is gonna be it for today. Very short video, but I did just wanna wrap this up and make sure I didn't miss anything before going on to the other routes. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and please subscribe. And in the meantime, I hope you all have a wonderful day.